Well, Pete, here we go, my man. This is the fully automated restore. When I click start, the test auto restore VM starts up, grabs Pixie boot, it grabs an IP address from the server. Uh, everything starts to run, including the uh, Macrium Reflect recovery console. And then from the Mac from the Macrium Ref Reflect recovery console, it goes into an automatic restore. You don't have to interact with it. It'll just finish and go all the way to the end. Uh, four, three, two, one, zero. Boom. Here's the restore. The restore is starting. Everything is working beautifully, as you can see. It's copying over the image. It takes a minute for the image to restore. Really, it doesn't take all that long. Thank you, NVMe drives. I appreciate it. Uh, but at the end of the day, this was really the missing piece from the demo. And the thing that the clients have been asking me for is how do we do an automated um, how do we do an automated deployment using deployment kit or technician's license? And this is in fact how we do it. So we can do an after restore. We're not gonna we're just gonna do a shutdown after the restore. Um, so once the restore is finished in just a moment here. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2. One, zero, restores complete. Uh, it'll do a shutdown. And I'm just going to go in and I'm going to remove the uh, backup drive from the restoration, from the settings here. Uh, backup drive is removed. And we're just going to edit the settings one more time so that we can uh, boot from the hard drive. Click OK. And when we click Start, here we go. We are taking that wonderful sysprepped image. We are booting up. And here you go, my friend. Windows 10. Completely automatically restored right up to the sysprepped image, which will ask you for credential, or which will ask you for to go through the completion of setting up windows. That, my friend, is how you do a full restore unattended from start to finish.